Russia, 150 million people, the largest country in the world, spanning 11 time zones. Over a thousand years of culture, history, intrigue, and mystery. Ornate palaces, giant squares, magical fountains, world-renowned literature, art, music, and the first man in space. Since 1991, when Perestroika opened Russia to the world, millions of visitors have poured into Moscow to marvel at Red Square, the unique onion domes of St. Basil's Cathedral, and the vast Kremlin grounds adorned with giant bells and cannons. Millions have come to St. Petersburg to view the incomparable wealth of the Hermitage Museum, the grandeur of Pavlovsk and Catherine palaces, and the magic of Peterhof fountains, where water is propelled by ingenious design and gravity, not by modern pumps or technology. But Russia is not just Moscow and St. Petersburg. Russia is also Gorica, a typical riverside peasant village, where you can break bread with an authentic local family. Russia's Uglich and Yaroslav and Kiji. But most of all, Russia is its people, old and young alike, who will impress you with their hospitality, humor, and generous spirit, their curiosity, intelligence, and their Slavic dusha, or soul. So pajalost, or welcome to Russia. Welcome to Russia! One of the best ways to explore this diverse country is by taking a river cruise along the magnificent Russian waterways. Our ships will take you to regions not accessible by any other means. You will sail and experience over 1,100 miles of Mother Volga, Europe's longest river. You will sail through 19 fascinating locks, four major rivers, and two of the largest freshwater lakes in the world, Lake Ladoga and Lake Onyega. All in the comfort of our fine floating hotels, with no packing and unpacking, where your meals, sightseeing, and the best cultural and entertainment programs are already included in your price. The classic Ernest Kronstadt, refurbished in 2006, holds a maximum of 240 passengers along with 110 crew members. Her cabins are clean and comfortable, featuring all lower berths, private bathrooms with showers, refrigerators, air conditioning, and lovely big picture windows that open. Aboard all our ships, meals are served in one seating, in our spacious panorama restaurants and night bars, and are complemented with a number of additional feasts and surprises, including blini and caviar tasting, piroshki and tea parties, and vodka and champagne galore. And after a full day of sightseeing, you can rest and relax in one of our elegant lounges, where a talented team of classical musicians, folklore dancers, and our live dance bands will entertain you until the wee hours of the morning. As either the starting or ending point of our Volga cruises, St. Petersburg is the highlight of any visit to Russia. Founded in 1703 by Peter the Great, it was the capital of the country until 1918. Affectionately called the Venice of the North, St. Petersburg was built over 42 islands linked by 65 rivers and canals. Thanks to its picturesque setting along the banks of the Neva River, its impressive architecture and a young and vibrant population, St. Petersburg is rightfully considered one of the most beautiful cities in the world. Your comprehensive sightseeing of St. Petersburg will feature all of the major attractions, from Peter and Paul's fortress to St. Isaac's Cathedral, to the humongous Palace Square and the 1,000-room Winter Palace of Catherine the Great. This is also the home to her private 350-room art collection, more commonly known as the Hermitage Museum. After another day of sightseeing, Time will come to bid St. Petersburg goodbye as you set sail on your Volga adventure. Enjoy our welcome cocktails and dinner and then party away as our onboard entertainers enthrall you with their playing, singing and dancing.
Your first stop downstream will be at the delightful green station of Mondraga, where a 19th century typical Russian village has been recreated. Here you will see artisans at work. and be able to purchase their creations. You will also have a chance to see the unique Vodka Museum, featuring over 2,500 versions of Russia's national drink. Then it's time to enjoy an authentic riverside barbecue with shashlik, wine, and special entertainment. Island, one of the 1,650 islands dotting the immense Lake Onega, is reminiscent of a fairy tale. The structures found on the island are authentic examples of traditional Russian wooden architecture from the turn of the century. The most spectacular is the Church of Transfiguration, whose 22 cupolas were constructed by Master Nestor without the use of a single nail. Back on board, it's time to take in one of our many cultural and entertainment activities. Enjoy a lecture on Russian history or Russian arts and souvenirs. A little bit about the history and what actually is happening with Fabergé eggs today. Then sit back and enjoy an onboard concert performed by our fabulous folklore ensemble. In the typical riverside village of Gorica, you will visit an authentic peasant house where you will meet the delightful Baba Valya or Grandma Valya, who will welcome you to her home and serve you her delicious homemade piroshkis and tea. The day will end with another treat our onboard caviar and champagne party. Nazdrovye! geographical center of the city Yaroslav. Yaroslav is founded on the high right bank of the Volga River. The Volga River is on your left, on your left, and the Kotros River is straight ahead and on your right. Founded in 1010 by Prince Yaroslav the Wise, Yaroslav is one of Russia's oldest cities. During the Middle Ages, it was a main trading center and one of three Golden Ring cities. Today, the Church of Elijah the Prophet boasts of some of the oldest original icons dating back as far as the 13th century. It is also home to one of the most renowned a cappella choirs in all of Russia. Listen. The town of Uglich is closely linked to the darker side of Russian history. It is here that the 10-year-old Crown Prince Dmitri, the youngest son of Ivan the Terrible, was murdered, which brought Boris Godunov to the throne and turmoil to the country. The day will end with a classic concert performed by Boris Gamus and Alexander Kolesnikov, two of Russia's most renowned classical musicians, who will fill the evening with romance and raw emotion.
As you continue sailing towards Moscow, the evening is reserved for our captain's gala dinner, featuring vodka, champagne, and entertainment. To you, dear guests, to your house, as we say in Russia, Nazdarovia. <laughs> Then, it's time for some silly fun and laughter at our talent show, where both passengers and staff will get to strut their stuff. <laughs> Welcome to the capital of Russia. With over 8 million inhabitants, Moscow is one of the world's largest and most important cities. Your tour will touch upon all of the major sites. Red Square with the imposing St. Basil's Cathedral and Gum Department Store. The huge fortress, or Kremlin, the seat of Russia's government, but also home to the ancient Tsar Cannon and the gigantic 200-ton Tsar Bell both of which are the largest in the world. Equally impressive will be your tour of the unique Moscow Metro, where several stations are world-class works of art. And decorated with the sculptures made by sculptor Manizer, one of the famous sculptors of Soviet Russia. And don't miss a stroll down Arbat Street, Moscow's popular pedestrian zone where modern fashion stores stand next to old world antique shops. Here, ladies can shop till they drop, while the guys enjoy some well-deserved R&R at one of the many open-air cafes. But no visit to Moscow is complete without a visit to the world-renowned Moscow Circus, featuring acrobats, jugglers, high-wire artists, and fascinating performances of man and beast working in tandem together. Sadly, as all good things must come to an end, so will your Russian river cruise as you disembark and head on home with a suitcase full of memories. We sincerely hope you have enjoyed this short introduction to Russia and the beauties of this fascinating country. We also hope that we will have the pleasure of your company on this or one of our many other worldwide river cruises in the very near future. Spasibo and do svidanie. Не слышны в саду даже шорохи. Всё здесь замерло до утра. Если б знали вы Как мне дороги подмосковные вечера. Если б знали вы, как мне дороги подмосковные вечера. Речка движется и не движется, Вся из лунного серебра. Песня слышится и не слышится В эти тихие вечера. Песня слышится и не слышится в эти тихи.